Spread out! Sir, Anna, to the left! Out of the car, now! Test, there! Circle them! Circle! They're moving in along the road! We have to flank them before they spread out and set a big kill zone here! Grenade! Move it! Get it over! them all right, didn't we? Yes, we did. The thing is, their army is in a massive raid now. And this is just... Hmm, the Baron sending his regards. How many of them are there? 700, I think. Whoa. Yeah, we locked out here. And we'd better not overstay our welcome. We won't get far burning twigs. Five clicks. It's at best. The dogs have fuel. Lots of it. A full tanker carriage on the rails. If we open gate quietly, we can steal it. They shouldn't have many guards now. Can you guide our men? I can. 
Let's get to business then. Jurmak, Crest, you prepare the Aurora. Finish filling the boiler with water and drain the car's tanks. Artyom, Damir, you get the most important part. Stealing that tank. Yes, sir. Good luck, gentlemen. Anna, idiot, Tokarev, we're breaking camp, people. Maybe we could still negotiate with them. I tried that already. No dice. It takes women. Hello, my friend. Totally radical job you did there. All this rejoicing over mere water. Must say, I love this taste of rust in the morning already, though. <laughs> Artyom, we took a look around. The main gate is guarded by a skeleton crew. You cannot go through gate. Go through the prison cellar where the Munai Bailer keep the slaves. Uh, <laughs> yes. In any case, the plan is this. Gul and I will try to take their guards down quietly and get in through the gate. If quiet does not work out, we will at least distract them, while you get in through the underground. Let's go. We'll walk with you. Don't lag behind. I have a favor to ask. If possible, don't kill the slaves. They're not... They just obey the Manai by Lair. Obey the Baron. They're afraid, that's all. Who is right about the locals? Here. This place. They're just kids, and all have been under brainwashing for ages. So we probably should take pity on them. So, a great? Well, let's do this. All right, I'll raise it and you get through. Great. See you up there. No use. Nobody go, nobody fool. We stand here, all day here. You suck. Better go hunt, find some food, make slave, more use that way. You said right, completely. Very right. You work or you go off the dog. Here, here, I see you. Come out 
to stop him. Oh, don't shoot! I just slaved the warrior! No weapon, no strength! Please don't shoot! Oh, we're all dead, we're all dead now! Enemy is here, now we kill all one by one! Oh, holy flame, will you get us? Worried for nothing. I have good news. Look, the tank is full. Just what we need. Um, there is also bad news. The gate is locked and we can't take it out. Colonel, sir, Damir here. We have secured the tank, but encountered a, a problem with the gate. Copy that. We're going with plan B then. Act accordingly. See, the cable connects the gate and the top of the tower. How do we get there, though? Oh, it looks like a veritable fortress. Gentlemen! Surely you're not seriously intending to attack our fortress. I do respect your courage, but simply throwing your lives away is such a waste. Who is in charge between you two? Come up here. We have things to discuss. Just you listen to that bastard talk. A complete about face. And we did throw a wretched into his plans big time. Point the gun down and come up. Otherwise, we'll have a pointless bloodbath on our hands. Agree now. Just do it. Jewel? Open the Where gate and let our guests in! I have up on the tower already. I have a plan. Look. Look at the gun. Come up! We won't even touch you. Unless you really ask for it. I don't like this, but Look at that there is no other way. If we don't get out of this desert, we're as good what as dead. What the fuck are you saying? 
If I fucking hear one more word about that bitch, go! Get over here! Go around them stinkers and just get to the next floor. Yeah, the boss hates stench. Don't you fucking catch it from him. Come on, why the fuck does he take so long? Ha! You must be one of the train gang. Just you take a fucking look at the beauty Vint is making for the Well, you just fucking pull it! Put your back into it! Why the fuck did you do that? I'm sorry, Master. I'm your slave. Was not on purpose. Shut up! Come on! What's taking so long? Just you fucking look in there. The whore drank master's Come on, up the ladder with you. It's one of those new arrivals. Come to me, the boss here. Hey, pretty boy. Did you come from afar? You're the one to see the boss? Come on in. Don't waste boss time here! Did you expect a different reception? <laughs> Alter your web. Here we can talk without the masks. I trust everyone present implicitly. You find it weird they're not really bothered by your little mischief. Well, you see, this world is a harsh and chaotic one. I'm just doing my best to introduce a little order into it. Without which there is no hope for something better in the future. But with no hope, you can't live. But let us cut to the chase. You definitely did not come here to enjoy the scenery. Ergo, you have a goal. And that goal is probably far from here. I respect people with a purpose in life. So, I am ready to provide you with fuel for your journey. I'm not asking for much in return. Surrender Gyor to me. Bring her to me, and we all win. I have fuel. You will have your fuel. Everyone gets to live long and prosper. Now. The Shigur herself has come for you. You will answer for everything. He locked it. From the other side, the coward! Do you think I am a fool? You didn't want to do it. Now you will all die! Starting with you, Gyo! Kill them! Artyom, get ready. We must kill these dogs!
Artyom, I'll go in before that dog runs away. I'll catch him and open the door for you. Hold on. You gave my people hope. I'll never forget it. But this war has only started for me, and I must see it to the end. The winning end. Artyom, your dream led us here, but it won't help my people. This war is mine now, too. Go, Artyom. Follow your dream. I was so worried. Coughing. We've left those sands long ago, and it still persists. <clears throat> what does Crest even smoke? <laughs> it's terrible. In any case, I'm better now. I hate to interrupt, guys, but uh, you should come to the mess hall. The table is almost served. Thanks, Stepan. We'll be there in a moment. Shall we go, Artyom? Or shall we stay a little longer? It's so nice. You know, Artyom, I've been looking at Stepan and Katya, you and me, and thinking how lucky we are. It was so different with my parents. It was bad.
Did I ever tell you why my mom died? Of course I didn't. It was because of Dad. He used to be even harsher back then. He used to come home from the barracks and reach for the bottle while taking off his boots. They'd quarrel, and then he'd stop appearing for a time. And while he was away, she'd start drinking too, and crying when she was sober. She'd feel better, would get kinda dreamy when drunk. You know how she used to call me, just A. She'd hug me and say, one day, A, you and I are going to go to Vladivostok, the city I was born in, and from there to a village on the ocean shore. I was five back then and didn't really get much, but I could imagine that village and the ocean so vividly because I believed her. And then she killed herself, drank some kind of poison. Father quit drinking after Mom's death. Didn't ever pay much attention to me, but with her gone, he'd never leave me alone. Took me along everywhere. We only talked about her a couple of times, though. I used to have this doll, Jana. I played make-believe that she was my daughter, and we went to the ocean together. Then my father hid it, told me it got lost. He probably didn't want me to agonize over Mom's dream. Then I imagine she grew up and went to Vladivostok. And now I'm going. Not to Vladivostok, but with you. The dream came true. By the way, I was always intrigued by what Dad dreams about. He should have some dreams, but what are they? Higher rank? He could choose any. Saving people? What would the saved do next? Sit underground? I never understood him. What does he hope for in life? What makes him happy? Go, Artyom. I'll rest some more and join you later. What do you know? <laughs> Everything is perfect, Artyom. Follow us. <laughs>